When the Queen took the throne in 1952, she was Queen of 33 separate countries around the world. When she died in 2022, that number was just 15, and so what happened to the other 18? I am glad you asked, because Pakistan in 1956 drafted a new constitution which excluded the monarchy, while Ghana and South Africa held referendums, which both were successful, although in South Africa's case only white people could vote. Is there a reason for that? Let me know in the comments. Anyway, in Tanzania and Malawi, they had four new constitutions, while in Nigeria, Uganda and Kenya just constitutional amendments were required. In Guyana, they went a step even lower and just passed a resolution saying there is no more queen, while in Zimbabwe, Sierra Leone, Sri Lanka, as well as Trinidad and Tobago, four new constitutions excluded the queen in the 60s and 70s, while in Malta, as well as, uh, it's, it's worth mentioning, Mauritius and Barbados, they just had constitutional amendments going from uh, the, the most recent, which was 2021, and the final country on this list, it is worth mentioning, is Fiji, which had a, checks note, military coup. 